Hi guys, how are you all? I'm sure you must be doing great. Okay, so I'm back with another video and our today's video is all about definite article the. I'm sure you all must have watched the video on indefinite articles that I have done and I told you that in that video we, uh, we are going to focus on definite on indefinite articles a or an. So our today's video is all about definite article the. So without wasting time i'll welcome you all in today's lesson my name is sanya so guys let's start our today's lesson okay so i'm going to give you certain rules with the help of which you will be able to use the very carefully now i'm going to tell you this with the help of example guys okay so the first example which we have is on monday an unarmed man stole 1000 dollars from the bank the thief has not been caught yet now definitely you guys must have noticed this an over here okay this an because it is unarmed that's why i've put an an unarmed man now guys okay so i have already mentioned about this man an unarmed man in the first sentence so when again i'm going to talk about this man i will not use a thief i will use the here okay so just like i told you that when we mention something for the first time we use either a or we use either an but when we mention that thing for the second time then we use the okay so the rule says when we mention something when we mention something for the second time all right guys so i hope this is clear to you so we'll move on now so the next sentence is the man who wrote this book is famous now guys pay attention the man similarly i scratched the red car parked outside now one more thing that i want to tell you here is that i use the when i am specifically pointing out a thing just like for example i say that i want to buy a phone okay so it can be any phone it can be a samsung phone it can be a nokia phone it can be apple it can be of any brand it can be android it can be ios it can be anything but if i say i want to buy an iphone so then again an iphone okay but if i want to say that i want to buy the new iphone so i am specifically saying that the iphone but which is the new one so over there i am using the so when i am specifying something when i am actually pointing out at something i am giving the exact detail of something then i will use the so see similarly i am saying the man who wrote this book just like for example consider this as a book okay so i'm specifically saying that the man who wrote this book like i'm specifically pointing out at this book that this book so whoever man wrote this book is very famous so that's why the man and not a man similarly i scratched the red car parked outside so now there is a parking lot and there are many cars parked over there but i am specifically saying that which car i have scratched so i have scratched the car which is of red color so i am specifically telling the car okay so i have i sorry i scratched the red car parked outside okay so when we specify things I hope this is also clear to all of you so okay so the next example or the next sentence which we have is this is 
द हाइएस्ट बिल्डिंग इन न्यूयॉर्क ओके सो गाइज इफ यू पे अटेंशन टू दिस सो दिस इज अ सुपरलेटिव लाइक यू नो देर आर मेनी बिल्डिंग्स इन न्यूयॉर्क बट देर इज वन स्पेसिफिक बिल्डिंग अबाउट विच आई एम टॉकिंग एंड आई एम सेइंग दैट दिस इज द हाइएस्ट बिल्डिंग लाइक यू नो नो बिल्डिंग इज हाइएस्ट एज दिस बिल्डिंग सो यू नो सो नाउ यू नो दैट देर इज कंपेरेटिव वेन वी कंपेयर टू थिंग्स एंड देन वी हैव सुपरलेटिव वेन वी कंपेयर अ थिंग विद मोर देन two things okay so with superlative this is a superlative because i'm saying the highest comparative is with er just like tall taller comparative and tallest okay similarly high higher and highest but over here this is superlative like this is the highest building no other building in new york is as highest as this building so when i use superlative so over there as well i will use the so the is also used with superlatives okay so the next sentence is she read the last chapter of the book now over here the last okay guys so this last is ordinal number so let me tell you what ordinal numbers are so when i say first second third fourth fifth sixth seventh eighth and so on last so those are the ordinal numbers okay so with ordinal numbers as well we use the just like i'm saying that she read the last chapter of the book so there is a girl and she was reading a book and finally she completed the last chapter of the book as well meant she read the last chapter of the book as well so with ordinal numbers as well we use the so with superlatives and with ordinal numbers okay okay so the next is he was born in the 70s this is a painting from the 1820s so what is this guys what i am talking about i am talking about he i am talking about a boy who was born in the 70s it actually means this who was born in the 70s means from like 71 to 79 or 70 to 79 so i am talking about a time period of 10 years which we call decade so with decades as well we use the like i am saying that you know this person is born in the 70s so maybe in 70 in 71 might be in 72 or 75 or in 79 as well so that makes up a total time period of 10 years so with decades as well we use the similarly this is a painting from the 1820s now i am saying like this painting is from 1820s so it can be from 21 it can be from 1825 it can be from 1827 as well so i don't know you know the exact year but i have taken a particular set of year in terms of 10 years so that time period of 10 year is decade so we also use the with decades so i'll write here for you time period of 10 years okay i hope this is clear to all of you okay okay so i think that this is the most common rule that we have heard of uh, in our childhood as well just like the things which are unique and which are one okay so we use the with them just like there is only one eiffel tower in the whole world okay which is in paris so i will use the with that similarly the sun now there is only one sun okay the sun revolves around the earth similarly there is only one earth so the things which are unique and are one in number we use the with them as well with unique things and names of famous monuments
or buildings just like i can say that i want to visit the taj mahal right because taj mahal is one okay okay so now uh, i have written three sentences over here guys so the first is the french enjoy cheese the french the elderly requires special attention and <clears throat> sorry she has given a lot of money to the poor okay now when i'm saying that the french enjoy cheese it means that i'm referring to the whole community of french i'm talking about that whole french group that all the french people i'm not talking about one person okay i'm talking about the whole french i'm talking about all the people who are french that the french enjoy cheese similarly if i'm saying the elderly require special attention so the elderly means all the people who are old they require special attention okay because many a times it happens that they they don't have anyone with them to take care of them so they do require special attention from their children as well okay similarly i am saying she has given a lot of money to the poor so here i am not talking about one particular person who is poor i am referring to the whole group of poor people okay so when we refer to a particular group as a whole over there as well we use the okay when we refer to a particular group as a whole right so means all the french people enjoy cheese they love eating cheese similarly all the old age people require special attention and there is a girl she has given a lot of money to all the poor people okay so guys these were few rules that i have discussed with you now there are more rules uh, which we use with the so i'm going to discuss those rules in another video because otherwise it will be too long for you guys as well to absorb all the points in one go so wait for that video and if you like this video and find found this video helpful do like the video subscribe to our channel and please comment and tell us what other videos you like to have and if you like so that is going to motivate me a lot and i will give my 100% or 200 or 300 or more than that in fulfilling all your wishes okay guys so till the next lesson bye take care and stay safe